What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is DJ Bolgedi, and welcome back to the second episode of the Let's Try of Deep Sixth. For those of you who didn't watch my previous video, go check it out because this game is cool. Deep Sixth is a sci fi roguelike horror adventure time management game with kick ass graphics, and yeah, it's amazing. Last episode, we managed to kill off a buoy that threatened us and killed a space squid kind of thingy. Anyways, we are now going to jump home to find out what our next mission is. Booyah! That was a close one, but you're alive and that's what counts. There's so much more to discover, and your manual is the key of it all. You can learn more about your ship from the rel re relative safety of yourself. Okay, let's survive. That's right. Reward points earned. Three. Good. I think that's good. So, Ursa, are we going to talk about the giant space monsters? It is prudent to remind you at this time that all involuntary employees are bound by an indefinite non-disclosure agreement for the duration of their sentence. <laughs> what happens after their sentence is up? Unknown. That has never occurred. Oh, wow. So, oh, wow. Monsters. Your onboard manual has now been updated to include a bestiary that includes any space-borne fauna that you have discovered. And well, that's cool. Already cataloged by other Astra cartographers. We can Pokemon this shit. Experiment with your approaches to these creatures and report your findings. Some creatures are resistant to certain laser configurations, while others are vulnerable. Great. So, how many more times do we have to do this? Astra Interstellar Solutions discourages artificial intelligence units from disclosing the remaining time in a pilot sentence. Perhaps you would like me to play you a cheerful song? <laughs> of course not. I am not an interactive script. Oh my god. This is so bad. So, do we have any messages? Doesn't look like it. Nope. Um... We get some sleep. And if my microphone mutes and I make a wobbly sound, then I'm coughing because I I still have the flu. Stardust still. Oh well. Let's go check out our. Oh, we can repair our ship. Let's repair that baby and let's upgrade it. So we can do this. Build flex 100% of the impacts. Plating. Minus 5% of damage taken. Retrieval probe. Huh. Well, uh, Probe Ike, welcome aboard. One battery storage, also nice. Battery size six. So we need... We, we have one more point. That needs two. That needs two. That needs two. Everything needs two. Okay. Um, repair. Hmm. Let's get some more sh more fuel rods. Yeah. And let's see the missions. Cool Goliath. 
Kill one Goliath, one photo, locate a new deposit, manufacture any compound. Let's take this one. And let's go on a mission. Uh, let's see. No life forms detected, so let's go there. Cruiserite, Cruiserite. Okay, let's go. Where's our local scanner? Oh. Okay. We need to target laser one up. Attention, pilot. With every fire, the laser will become more misaligned. Not only does this reduce your effectiveness, it may also damage the laser. What can I do? You can realign the laser at any time. I would suggest looking up the steps for realignment in the troubleshooting section of the manual under Lasers Weakened. You will need to look at how misaligned the laser is. What's this? Find an appropriate configuration to compensate and attempt to recreate that combination in the laser configuration panel. Okay. I don't know what just happened. Um Laser reconfiguration. Viewing rooms, laser. Make sure there's no power I'll get to the targeting subsystem. The targeting system cannot be operational. Go to the viewing room console. Select and reinstall corrupted drives. Okay, so we have to do this. Targeting. Reinstall. Running drive. Oh, okay. why is this all remote? Oh, laser. Okay, I have no idea how to fix this. Um, rotate ship, system drive, deploy cargo. No, no, what's this? Chemical manufacturing. Attention, pilot. Irregular motion detected in the sector. <laughs> wait, what? Whoa, what? Wait, what? Oh, three. Okay, we need to go to three. Okay, let's uh, let's shoot this. Uh, no, no, hold on. We need to make a picture first. And now we'll shoot it. Laser type check to laser configuration panel. Where you can switch between the laser types and the collaboration laser at the top, you can see the two buttons that are used to switch between steady and malating laser. Some creatures are more vulnerable against one of these laser types. Okay, let's uh, switch to that one. Okay. Our 
ship and not take a lot of damage. When an impact is imminent, hit the shields quickly to absorb the blow. Uh, shield. I'm hitting the shield. Did we kill it? Did we kill it? Whew, I think we killed it, but wh how do we do we get the shields up? I have no idea. Oh yeah, now it works. We're crying out loud, now it works. Okay, um, targets, locate a new, take one photo of Goliath, you one Goliath. But that wasn't a Goliath. Manufacture any compound. Okay, how do we do that? And how do we fix stuff? Uh, reactor room, because I need more power. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Get you in there. Close up the door. Oh, integrity. Okay, now let's go back. Main menu. Took a picture of it. What's wrong now? One photo of Goli oh Goliath, not a reaver. Okay, okay, okay. My bad. My bad. Viewing rooms. Oh wow, this is, this is, this is hard. That's, that's hard. Yep. Um... Let's uh, turn off our scanner. Uh, where's where's that? Where is our? I do hate it where when every room is laid out differently. Okay, scanner can go off. Console this thing. Manufacturing. I have no idea how this works. No idea. Okay, let's uh, dump this and dump this. And... I want to know how we can mine shit. Shields. Dang it. There it is. Oh, wow. That was dumb. Okay, uh, let's go to the hyperdrive room. Let's all go to the hyperdrive room.
Why can't I go there? What's there? Am I there now? Oh, I'm there now. Okay. Let's, uh... Ah, oh, dang it. Okay, let's speed up time. <sighs> yep, that's gonna take a while. That is gonna take a while. Well, ladies and gentlemen, looks like uh, we're gonna end this video a bit earlier than the last video, but 50 minutes is not that bad. So, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, and if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel for more Let's Try and for more Deep Six, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye! <laughs>